topic. Oh, uh, oh, oh, wow. Uh, crazy, crazy, crazy crossover crap. Um, oh, 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 yeah. Uh, <laughs> like, so has anybody even heard of Cookie Run Kingdom? I no. never I have heard not. Of no. Oh, like, I never even heard of it before Run. this was announced. I'm like, what the heck is it's, it's it's another mobile game it's not one of those gotcha mobile games where you just like mm. uh just play through and kind of unlock stuff and and i guess if you want to yeah. unlock more stuff you gotta you know dish up the money up front so to speak that's you... basically any mobile game in a nutshell oh i basically. know <laughs> but Nowadays. now they, yeah. they... Have, you played, have you played any of the king mobile games like candy crush it's literally like yeah, that. It, yeah, yeah, mm. very generic. Even even the uh the seg the Sega uh that one Sega Heroes game. I think it was Sega Heroes. It's like I, I think I think it was yeah. You know, it's like I I wanted to unlock some of the character. I wanted to unlock Shadow so freaking bad, and it's just like oh, <laughs> uh, because I was I was struggling through some of the levels there. It was just like mm, mm. I hate this. I hate the hell this design. I hate. Well, I say design. I I hate the uh the mechanics. Really, oh. it's it's a it's it's those um uh, it's those paywall mechanics that I really really hate more than anything yeah. else. I mean, the only yeah. the only video game mobile game that I kind of that I'm mostly active on is Mario. There's a Mario Kart game for the iPhone, and I basically am active on that like. As much as possible. It's like I've or, I've given up. Yeah. I've pretty much given up on most mobile games because it's almost always the same thing nowadays. It's like the pretty same much. same yeah. game, different skin. Yeah. 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 I think if you play one mobile game, you basically just played them all. Yep. Pretty much. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. So yeah. So this whole Cookie Run Kingdom, and you know, got Sonic involved. So. You know, you play it through to try to unlock Sonic and Tails, I guess, some mm. things. I I never, so I know, like I said, never even heard of this game, so it's like I don't even know what it's really about. So I could, so you know, we see it on Twitter. <laughs> but that's out there for people who do happen to play it, or you know, want to find another mobile game they want to play that has Sonic in it. So. Yeah. Of course, there's like half a billion crossovers with Sonic coming in nowadays. It seems. Oh, yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. what 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 franchise has Sonic not gone a crossover with? Probably a couple. I, I mean, mean I know a few I can think of off the top of my head. <laughs> I know Sonic did one with Mega Man, I think, and Sonic needs to do one with Kirby. <laughs> I mean, unless you want to count to. Unless you want to count Super Smash Brothers. I was just going to say. <laughs> please give us Sonic Monster Hunter crossover, please. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Wait. I mean, what, Sonic, Sonic Monster, Monster Hunter, oh my god. Oh, man. Maybe I'm just maybe I'm just losing it right now. I could have sworn that was already a thing. Maybe I'm thinking of another game, though. Oh. I know they've done, like... I think they have done Mega Man stuff though before because it's a Capcom game, so they've done. You That's know, what the comics. Their own thing. I know I mean, the I, comics. I know, they did that. Yeah, yeah the comics. They mm -hmm. did. Yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I always wonder, like, if Marv, if Sonic were to somehow be part of Marvel, then they'll, then they'll, they'll probably be part of the new Marvel Capcom game. Uh, That's I, I will, say, <laughs> I will say, I will say, not because it, my it, Marvel. It, I mean, because like it, it's he, like he was almost in the cross. In in a crossover of um was it um the uh, was it project what was it project X or something no project mm. zone project oh um, yeah project zone yeah I know what you're talking about that RPG yeah, yeah because like it, they had the combination of Sega um Capcom and what was the other one. I know project X I with, with, it, project X involved all the major uh players of uh of the console wars so it's Nintendo? pretty much uh, yeah it was pretty much uh Sega and capcom yeah i don't know if capcom ever made a console though i know nintendo and sega has but i don't know if, Com if capcom ever did make a console no, i don't i, I remember there, there no, was no, a, there was a second game it was a console war and most like it's more of a like um the uh the triple like a companies of video game companies yeah. Well, I oh, I remember okay. yeah. I remember there was there was a you know, I thought it was Project X though that, that was involved the uh, 
the uh, the console war because uh, each uh, char- uh, the main characters embody the uh, the major okay, players here, here, like here, us. Uh, okay, so. so Sega Mew actually posted on, on Twitch chat. Uh, Project X Zone, Sega Capcom, and ba- and Bandai. Bandai. Okay. <laughs> That's the one. Yes. Thank you, Sega Mew. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and, and somebody said that um, there are two cross Sonic had two crossovers with Mega Man. Uh, worlds collide and worlds unite. Yeah, that was those were the different. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, the, the, yeah. the worlds, the worlds unite. They had they expanded and brought even more from Capcom and the Sega verse to uh, put them all there. It was it was such a gigantic thing. It was almost almost a gigantic mess to be honest, uh, <laughs> because there was yeah. so 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 many characters to keep track of. It, mm-hmm. it was just like, uh, you know, they got them from. I, I guess it was Street Fighter. Or no, was was it Street Fighter? Maybe. Uh, Maybe I don't. I'm not, I'm not quite. I sure. I don't know. It, it was like I said. It was a lot of Capcom games that they, you know, they brought in some characters from. Mm-hmm. Uh, Lord Virtual. <laughs> I don't know. It, it's I had to go mm-hmm. back and look at my comics, and even then, uh, those are those are a little more scattered about, messed up because of the fact that they kept jumping series all over the place. It's just like. Uh, Sonic Universe, oh, yeah. uh, mm-hmm. Sonic Boom, Sonic, uh, the the normal Sonic, and um, uh, Mega Man. Sonic it's Universe. Like... Yeah, that's, Sonic that's Universe. Yeah, Sonic Universe. <laughs> yeah, four. Yeah. They were jumping four different titles to uh, get the storyline across, and I'm like, I had trouble keeping track of everything. Which one is in what order? Uh Okay, so. So and, Sega all, and Sega Mew also posted on um, uh, Capcom IP they brought in was Street Fighter, Akami, Mega Man, Go- Ghouls and Ghosts and Goblins, etc. Okay, yeah, there was Street Fighter. There was Ryu, Ken, yeah. Chun Li, and Guile. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. Okay. So yeah, crossovers. It's a thing. But you know, Sonic with IDW now, and um, the 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 crossover potentials for from IDW are just you know something All the else. Place, oh, oh my absolutely. gosh! I mean, they mm-hmm. freaking did ponies and Transformers for crying out loud! Right. I'm like, how? Ha- I I have not had a chance to read that, but oh my gosh, just thinking about it, I'm like, oh. You know, one of like, one of my one of my biggest Army. favorite crossovers that I think IDW did was when they did uh, Star Trek and Doctor Who. It was like, oh, 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 oh yeah. I was so happy about that. I I collected the entire uh, set set for that one because I because I loved I, I loved uh, Star Trek and I loved Doctor Who and I liked the fact that it was my favorite Doctor they were using. Uh, the apparently, um, IDW also did the crossover of Power Rangers and TMNT. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> kind of forgot about that. Yeah. Well, that about, what, the, um... yeah, you got to realize that Power Rangers already did a crossover with TMNT. Like, yeah, way... I was about oh, to mention yeah, right now. Yeah, the old one. It was um, it was in space. In space. It, in it, space. Was, it was like the next mutation, I think. Next mutation it's with the in space. Called the next mutation. Yeah, the yes, next mutation it where they had four turtles all grown up, mm-hmm. and one of and one of them was a girl. Mm-hmm. Like a yeah, the fifth, one, the fifth one was a girl. And that yeah, was yeah. Like the lost um, live action. Like it's hard to do like a ver- like a, a, a show of TMNT where where it was completely live action, because um, back then they ha- like the live action TMNT TV was popular. They wanted to do like more projects with the live action costumes, but unfortunately, that they, 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 they kind of gotten worse as the years went on. Because keep in mind, Team and T, they had oh gosh, the coming out of the show's tour, their Christmas special, the Turtle Tunes, I think, <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, getting down your town, and then they did the. Um, yeah, and then they then, also then, they then, also then, did then some then special then. promos like for the uh, L.A. transport system. That I, yes, oh, that's cool. Cool. <laughs> I used to have that VHS. Oh my god! What was but DC, I think actually, I think actually, oh Ladise showed that to me. I think Ladise showed that to me actually. 
I mean, because I live in LA and I use and I use the public transportation. So I mean, I don't know how how my mom rest in peace. I don't know how my mom got her hands on that, but like I remember watching it. There was I don't know, it's so much. I can't even remember. I was it's like I was I was a kid back then. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. Mm -hmm. But it's most likely like um, it's um, showing like um, how to use the pu public transportation of the blue line, because um, that back then um, they finished with the um, um, the rail um, of a uh, metro blue line and then the red and green line, and they only use I can't remember much, but I think they only showed the blue and uh, and red line um, showing how how to use the uh, the light rail transportation, and then there's the uh, I I think there was a villain in in that in that uh, was it Gridlock? I think yeah, it was Gridlock. <laughs> I'm like oh my, yeah, back then it was, then, like, it was huh? yeah, it was probably like the it was the only villain like Gridlock was only appeared in that in that clip alone and never appeared in any of the other. TMNT things anywhere. Yeah. I mean, like, the yeah, because only... They... Yeah, because the only villains we ever we ever know about with TMNT are, or because for me anyway, Strider, Bebop, and Rocksteady. Those are the only villains that I know of. Yeah, because, like, I mean, it, it makes sense very long, and with the L.A. traffic, and still the L.A. traffic as it is today. <laughs> and, like, um, yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> um... So yeah, lots of crossover potentials, especially with IDW. It's like you know, yeah. it could go anywhere, do anything. Yeah, and I, like a five million I think now is, if we, I think I think for a future show, we should talk about what possible crossovers IDW will think of next. Yes. I have to look at IDW's library to see uh, what uh, what possible crossover Sonic can do with who, because. Uh, oh. Somebody, somebody wanted, wants to see Sonic, Sonic and Team and T. And second view actually said, um, Team and T already has dimension traveling character with Usagi Yojimbo. Mm -hmm. It'll be easy to write in how Sonic interacts with Team and T. Yeah, makes sense. Very, very yeah, very, yeah. Very, very, very mm -hmm. yeah. So, uh, mm -hmm. without going overboard, what's next on the agenda? <laughs> 